So we're here with Kiri today and he's the founder of eMark. Hey guys, Ben's from Malaysia as well. So Ashtag Origins in the US, he's making it big out there. So welcome back Ben and we're gonna do a build together later with the Pro yeah. Art. So it's been a while but we're back again because we, I think we kind of need this collab so let's see what <laughs> we got today. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Today we have an exciting collaboration with our friends from Malaysia, eMark. So if you are in the Southeast Asia region and you're looking for a custom gaming PC, since we don't ship to you, you can always reach out to our friends at eMark. But we're gonna go inside and we're gonna do a collab. So let's go check them out. We are here. I can already see the, uh, the parts over here. Sneak peek. Hello, anyone home? Ring the bell. His name is Kiri. What's yeah, up, man? man? How's it going? Oh my god. Long time What's no up? see. Sup? <laughs> this is vlog. Sorry, oh, sorry. it's uh, pretty messy. I, I made up uh, this place right here because we're gonna shoot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we'll have the background here. Yeah. Let's take a look at what eMark store looks like. Hello. Hello. Huh? My name is Kiri. Maybe you should sit, the, sit on the gaming chair. <laughs> <laughs> I think the framing will be too low. Hi, I'm Kiri from Imak Malaysia. Hi, my name is Ben from Archetype Origins. And today we're going to be doing a collab with Imark. Uh, we reached out to Asus for a pro art build and they sent us a bunch of stuff. So I'm going to have Kiri uh, explain what we have here. So we're gonna do a build together. So today we have a full Pro Art build running the RTX 4080 Super, the latest one. And also we'll be running the Pro Art X670E Creator Wi-Fi running an AMD Ryzen 9 7950X. Wait, 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 let me check. Processor, what processor is this? Oh no, it's a Ryzen 7 7700X. <laughs> <it. laughs> Pro Art LC420 liquid cooler, which is a super massive liquid cooler. We're gonna mount in that big chassis. The Pro Art TA602 will show some features that only this chassis have later. We have the power supply, ROG Tor Platinum 2, 1000 watts, and also 32 GB of GDR5 RAM. We'll see if we'll add more RAM in the future. And also topped off to complete the setup is a Pro Art monitor, PA279 CRV. So let's do the build. These brokers are doing their best to collect and sell your information to scammers, spammers, and anyone else who might want your information. And this brings us to today's sponsors, Aura. If you have a PC, you are most likely connected to the internet. Your full name, email, home address, phone number, and relatives, it's all out there. Aura shows us which data brokers are selling our information and automatically submits opt-out requests for us without us even needing to lift a finger. When we type in Jenny's name, it shows 18 different data brokers have Jenny's information, exposing us to spam, robocalls, and other unwanted advertising. To protect your privacy, Aura sends out requests to have you removed from these online databases. The benefit of cleaning up your information not only helps reduce the amount of spam you get, but also protects from hackers who want to gain access to your online accounts, banking information, and other sensitive information. Not only does Aura remove your information from data brokers, it also has other great features to protect you while you're online such as antivirus, VPN, password management, parental controls, identity theft insurance, and more without having to download several different apps. The interface is really easy to set up and very user-friendly. Best of all, all these great features are bundled into one location at one great price. We value our privacy and we also value yours. You can go to aura.com slash archetype or click the link down in the description below to start your two-week free trial. Now let's get back to the video. So let's do the build. So this PA602 Pro Art is the first unit in Malaysia. It's quite a big chassis. I think uh, first impressions wise, it's quite nice. <laughs> Almost draws. <laughs> At the same time, I can see first impressions, it's pretty nice. 
uh, big, bulky, has good ventilation ports all over the place. I think it's a ventilation port, like Ben pointed out earlier. Yeah, I think it's I a Pro Art ventilation port, which would look perfect and beautiful with Pro Art GPU. Get the airflow going. If you have like GPU yeah. air coming in up and exhaust to the top, I think. Yeah. It even has like a little instruction panel here. I think uh, I almost dropped the side panel earlier. <laughs> uh, smart filter, have a button you can press here. Let's see how it works later. Yeah, I'm actually very curious about this smart filters. Like, is it like something like what Dyson is doing? Do you have to change out the filter every once in a while? Maybe we, there's something we can see later in the manual or something like that. Yeah, there's the blast panel on its own. You can see the interior. There's a lot of features here. It looks like it has a GPU holder, a 200 millimeter fan times two for intake, and also an exhaust fan, and also 360 or 420 mount at the top, which I think will serve as good intake to exhaust. Just like uh, most of the chassis in the market, it supports MATX, full-size ATX, EATX, and ITX. But for a case like this, you probably want to stick with the full Pro Art lineup. That's why we're going to go with the regular ATX motherboard. So there's one very interesting feature about this chassis. Uh, is this wheels on the back? I'm not exactly sure when you're going to use it. Maybe when you move around your chassis around in your room, you can kind of take advantage of this wheel or you want to pop a wheelie for your case. It's like slide it around your room like a luggage or carry around the airport. So this PC is portable? Yeah. Portable PC, in a sense. <laughs> portable. One very interesting feature is, uh, so far, we're still not using any thumb screw yet. They're all press and release. So that's a very nice feature of this case too. It has very clean Pro Art accents, even at the back. You can see the cable management routing, pretty clean. But at the same time, I don't think you'll be looking much at the back. It's just, I think, a very clean outlook. Three HDD drives, mountable at the bottom, and decent PSU space. But I think with the HDD drives, plugged in, you'll have limited cable routing options because there's limited space to curve your cables before going up. So basically you have 420 millimeter radiator. I think this is the biggest you can get on a close lip liquid cooler all in one. 140 millimeter times three. Has a very decent pump with some indicator levels here. This looks like a perfect liquid cooler for your workstation. It comes with three Noctua 140 millimeter EPC industrial fans. Pretty good performance.
Hey guys, so we realized that the smart filter on this chassis is just a LED indicator that lights up when there's a lot of dust on the front of the chassis. So you just long press it to enable it and disable it. So I don't I don't see a reason to disable it and the button is there just to disable it. But uh, I mean it's a nifty feature and we just don't don't want to realize that you've not cleaned your PC in a long time and it's really dusty so the LED indicator is just there to let you know like hey what's up you, <laughs> time to clean up <laughs> yeah so I, I don't think there's anything unique about this other than the fact that they're just able to let you know that it's filled with dust but I'm not sure how it exactly works and how they're able to detect that but hey I guess something cool with this chassis all right guys that's pretty much the end of today's video Huge shout out to Kiwi from Amark for letting this build happen and also special thanks to Asus for sending us over the part for this Pro I built. So let me know what you guys think about this build. Is that something that you guys would consider doing it yourself or would you rather go with like a RGB build instead? And if you're in Malaysia, be sure to hit our friend Kiwi over here from Emark for your custom gaming PC. Until next time. Until then, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Yeah. <laughs>